To give you some context, the barricades here behind me were put up two years ago and the fencing was installed a year and a half ago. Richmonders say now it's time for them to go, but city officials say they'll have to wait at least several more months until that happens. During his morning scooter stroll, Christopher Tyson Blair rides past this empty plot of land, a space that's closed off. It's upsetting because they used to come over here with friends and we walk around the circle, whatever, hang out around the statue. Profanity ridden barricades and fencing still surround the circle on Monument Avenue, which used to host the statue of Confederate General Robert E. Lee. It's a real shame that it has to be like this. Here's a brief timeline. The barricades went up June 2020. The fence, January 2021. The statue was removed September 2021, and the pedestal taken apart December 2021. Fast forward to June 2022, and neighbors want to know why the barriers remain. I would say the sooner the better take it down. It's been barricaded since I've been here, and it's been almost a year. Jody Dingra lives across the street. The fencing itself is a bit of an eyesore. And she misses the times when... It was a gathering space um, for a lot of individuals, um, a community garden, um, and I'm definitely looking forward to them opening it back up. But that's not going to happen until at least, quote, sometime in the fall, according to Mayor LeVar Stoney's office. City officials say they're waiting for the sprinkler system to be fixed and for the grass to establish itself. Uh, it makes no sense, honestly. Tyson Blair wonders if the delay in reopening the circle has anything to do with concerns over crowds. You might recall in 2020, tons of folks gathered here to protest racial injustice, sometimes becoming tense and clashing with police. If it gets to a point where it's people are coming back here causing more issues and more chaos, it's like, do they really have a reason to open it up? The city says it also has plans to landscape the area and plant shrubbery until a long-term vision as part of the reimagined Monument Avenue project is decided.